Hey, what is up, guys? This is the uh, other battle I mentioned the other day. Um, sorry that didn't go up Saturday. Some things came up and just wasn't around to record. So um, I also had another couple plans, but as you can see, um, don't really have anything today. Unfortunately, this these whole past couple weeks have just been absolutely terrible. So um, hopefully later this week I'm going to have what I plan to do for this week specifically. Since it is leading up to Halloween, I will have it later this week. So you can see this is the multi-battle. I'm bringing with me a Hitmonlee, a Feralgator, and a Metagross. Um, I figured after the last time, after playing really hyper-offensively, it would be better if I played a bit more safe. Um, so I just brought with me a, a little bit safer Pokemon. Um, I know Hitmonlee is not necessarily the best, but it actually does some pretty good work in this battle. So I was happy with it and pleased. Uh, my partner brings Sableye again, and... Uh, you're going to see a normal gym, um, boosted fake out, uh, take uh, Conkelder. Uh, he's going to go ahead and burn it too. Uh, sorry for the camera adjustment there. I was trying to just uh, center the, the picture a bit better. So, now everyone's going to taunt uh, Sableye, which is not really the best just because of the fact that if it was we did want to set up uh, recovers, it wouldn't have the chance to. Um, so, Conkelder's burned probably. Oh, he burned from the flame orb. So, more than likely, guts boost, uh, safe to say. Uh, my partner's going to switch out go into Selby. I'm going to rock slide away. It's going to do a ton to uh, Noivern, and it's not going to do a lot to Conkelder at all. Um, so, uh, Noivern's going to Air Slash, which surprisingly does not take him only out. I was really surprised, and uh, Conkelder's going to go for Stone Edge and going to miss. Um, Noivern's going to continue to take burn damage as long as as long as Conk is as well. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and go for Rock Slide again this turn. Uh, like I said, Hitmonlee doesn't necessarily do the the best in this match, just because it's not really a high tier. But the normal gym boost is just laughable, so I figured why the heck not. Um, it's it's one of my, it's just a Pokemon that I really like to use regardless of what's going on. So um, yeah, that's what I brought it. Uh, Kakelder's going to go for Drain Punch on the Selby. Uh, I'm not really sure why target was Selby there. Um, but going to get a decent amount of damage off and um, get some health back for Nika Kelder. So that's not big of a deal. Going to bring in Pidgey out here. Uh, Bird Jesus, however, is going to do a lot in this battle. Um, partner's going to switch back out and go into Sableye, I do believe. Oh, no, goes into Raikou. That was, that was a stupid assumption of mine. Uh, it's going to have the pressure on the field. Um, going to Mega Evolve Pidgeot. Uh, Unfortunately for me, uh, in the long run, Hitmonlee is going to go down uh, in the next couple turns. Uh, I do go for a Rock Slide this turn. Does not knock out Pidgeot. Really was hoping it would, but it's going to do a little over half, and it's not going to do much to Kinkelder. And I am going to get the Flinch, however, on this Pidgeot, so that's awesome. Uh, Drain Punch on the Raikou is going to do a ton of damage, leave him with 11 HP and almost back to full health. Which is really unfortunate because th this thing's just a pain to do damage to. Uh, it's gonna wide guard here, um, which really sucks because in this turn, um, since I don't get the hit, the uh, the Pidgeot is setting up the Roost, which really sucks. Um, I really wish I had had a way to get around that, but you know, it happens and that's okay. Um, Raikou is gonna go for extra sensory, uh, which is enough to take Kelder out. Um, just of course, it's kind of a dirt kind of situation, but. It happens, and uh, Tila's going to send out Scissor, uh, and he's going to Mega Evolve here in a second, I do believe, if is correct. So, no, both of my opponents have um, Megas on the field, which really sucks in the long run. And, uh, unfortunately, I am going to go down to a Bullet Punch, so... Or, no, Raikou's going to go down to a Bullet Punch first. So, uh, my, me and my partner aren't necessarily doing the best this turn. Uh, Scissor's going to avoid the Rock Slide. Uh, it's going to hit Pidgeot, and that's going to do a decent lot. Unfortunately, still not enough to knock it out. I do get the flinch, however, though, which is awesome. Uh, opponent's going to bring back in the Celebi, and just going to bullet punch the him only, and him only goes down. So, I'm going to go into Feralgator this next turn uh, as Pidgeot Roos, um, which really sucks. I really wish I'd been able to do more against Pidgeot, but there's just only so much you can do. So Selby's going to recover. Uh, it's going to get back to full health. And I'm going to bring in for Alligator. Uh, not really too worried, really. Uh, however, is going to Hurricane. Does not do a lot to me. Um, and Selby's going to go for Parish Song. 
Uh, really didn't see that coming. Uh, you don't just don't you don't just don't see Parish Dance used very often. Uh, and I'm gonna set up a Dragon Dance. Shouldn't have set up. That was stupid of me. Uh, unfortunately, uh, I'm just gonna go down to a. Uh, what am I gonna go down to? Do I even get anything off? I don't remember. Man, I have horrible memory of this battle. Um, but I do believe uh, Harden's gonna switch back out again for the millionth time. Go into Sableye, and uh, I do believe, yeah, Bull Punch is gonna take my Feraligator out. Sucks. Uh, I was the target this battle, which really was unfortunate. Um, but that's what happens. Uh, that's what we did to Tilo last battle, and uh, unfortunately, it's just gonna happen to us this time. And we're for the most part just gonna get absolutely wrecked here. So that's unfortunate. Um, and now all I've got left is my uh, Mega Metagross. So, and I know that thing's not going to be able to do much against the, uh, the scissor, so it's not really that big of a deal, but I tried my hardest in this battle with, especially with trying to play so different from my normal play style, um, it just couldn't be helped this time around, so that's unfortunate. Scissor is going to go for a bullet punch, it's going to take out the Sableye, and so, yeah, as you can imagine, that's pretty much at this point the end of the battle. Uh, all my opponent has left is... I don't remember, but Metagross is going to take a heat wave, going to go down really low health. Uh, Zen Headbutt, however, is, I do believe, going to take out Pidgeot. Uh, really wish I had done that sooner, but I just, I didn't know at the time, and I didn't really want to risk it, because I know these things normally rock um, a heat wave. So, Miss Magius is going to come in, and uh, my opponent's going to send back in the Celebi, and at this point, that's pretty much GG. Uh, Metagross is going to bolt punch uh, Scissor. I just wanted to get a little bit of damage off, just in case something could be done. Uh, unfortunately not, Metagross is going to go down to the bullet punch. And, yeah, so I'm knocked out of the battle now, officially. And it's pretty much, I think, three on one at this point. So, uh, Selby is not going to go down to the first Shadow Ball. However, we do lose the special defense, and Healing Wish isn't going to do anything. So Scissor's going to go to the Parish Song. I forgot that happened. I forgot Scissor went down to that, so... That was interesting, and uh, Teal is going to bring in Milotic. And at this point, you know it's pretty much game, because Miss Magius is going to fire off another uh, Shadow Ball, and that's going to be all she wrote for Selby. So, thanks for watching, guys. I do appreciate it. Like I said, I do have some plans for later this week, since it is a, oh, quote-unquote, I say this very loosely, holiday. So, thanks for watching. I do appreciate it. I will see you guys later this week, hopefully with some content. I'm going to go play Halo 5. I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching. I do appreciate it. Bye, guys.